that. <laughs> so I'm going to jump to a good friend of mine, a woman who came to the Button Retreat to Bond. So mm -hmm. I want to say uh, thank you to um, Gina Polino and a shout out to her husband, John, whose birthday it is today. So Gina, uh, Gina runs a great nonprofit. So Gina, tell us all about what you're doing. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you for inviting me here today. And John actually went to run out and get the dinner of his choice for his birthday. So um, I, when he comes back, I'll make sure that he knows everyone wished him a happy birthday. Thank you. Um, so yes, I, um, I run a small nonprofit, like the day-to-day -day operations for Mains and Motions, which is a therapeutic horseback riding program um, here in town. And um I, uh, it's a wonderful organization. We're actually uh, affiliated with the Hospital for Special Care, um, which is a great affiliation. <clears throat> um, and we serve children and adults uh, and veterans with various needs that could benefit from time spent with the horses and doing different activities with them, guided by um, our staff. And, um, I think, you know, it's, um, and we, we are supported by, um, right now, we're, our volunteer core is down. It was about 150 pre-COVID, but now we have about 80 volunteers a week. Um, so we're very fortunate. It's, um, it's a nice environment. And by that, I guess, um, you know, uh, I know that uh, energy was mentioned, you know, being positive, um, really promoting an environment um, to accept everyone as who, for who they are and um, in love. I know that um, sometimes when you talk about love, you know, people get a little squeamish, um, but it's not a four letter word. It's a good four letter word, I should say. <laughs> and um, it's definitely the type of environment that we try to promote at the program. Um, I've been involved in therapeutic riding and equine activities for over 20 years now, and um, it just never ceases to um, inspire me. Um, the people that are involved with uh, the industry, volunteers, um, their participants that come, the different organizations that I have contact with. So <clears throat> I'd love to, if anybody has any particular questions or I could share a personal story about the program, but <clears throat> otherwise I'll kind of open it up. Yep. Okay. What's it called again? Um, move in motion? Mains, M-A-N-E-S, oh. the amp ampersand motions. So mains, a main is, um, the long hair on the horse's neck. Right. So, uh, I can't say enough about how fortunate I am to be able to not just work with the people, but with the horses. The horses yeah. bring that quiet energy yes, um, to do. the program and um, they support and I, well, so they provide that non-judgmental format um, for people that are struggling just to feel accepted and they teach us many lessons about ourselves in life. Yes, they um, do. Just G by gentle out. giants in the most extreme sense. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Um, yes. I, it's, <laughs> you know, I, I think I want to share a story that kind of comes to mind because um, the program that I'm with now currently, Mains Emotions, I actually helped start over 20 years ago. And then after the program was on the ground, I, I, it was my dream to work full-time in the industry. And that program wasn't at that place then. So I worked at a number of other centers full-time. And the last center I worked at before Maine's Emotions, um, I went to visit this couple that invited me to their farm just to see what they were doing with therapeutic riding. It was a very small program. They were looking to grow it. And oh, we had such an amazing conversation that lasted like three hours. And I ended up giving my notice to the other center I was working at to oh. go be with this couple because they really taught me about um, that everything in life comes down to fear or love. The choices we make, what we wanna promote, 
how we deal with everything in our lives comes down to those two things. And I think I've taken and carried that philosophy with me forward um, ever since then. And it, it has never failed me. Again, when you interact with people, if you do it with love in your heart, um, that energy comes forth and um, everything is better. <laughs> Thank you awesome. so much. Thank you, Gina. Appreciate that.